what is pegaxi welcome back guys it's crypto rocko from rockstar trading channel in this video guys i'll share with you everything that you need to know about pegaxi how to race how to breed share with you my thoughts on the project the team how to buy your first pega if you can't afford to buy your first pega i'll share with you how you can rent it for free and start earning some money today share with you long term how much money you can look to earn as well talk about breeding breeding is an amazing part of the game it's very profitable Profitable. I'll share with you my breeding strategies, what to breed, how to breed, use a calculator to talk about how much you could look to invest and how much you could look to earn. I'd leave the calculator link in the comment section below so you can download it yourself and play with it. And at the end of the video, guys, I'll touch on my thoughts on the project long term. The price of Pegaxi, Viz and PGX have dropped a lot. It could be a really good entry point if you believe Pegaxi prices will have another crazy rally. I'll talk about the game. I'll let you decide. But I believe Pegaxi will get another rally so this could be a really good time to enter so the end of the video i'll talk about pro the project long term and share with you my price prediction for viz and pgx and share with you a good time to potentially get in buying racing playing the game yourself also guys i'll share with you live gameplay of a racing hopefully we can win some whilst we are racing and finally before i get started if you want to win a free pega make sure you comment below your meta metamask polygon address below and i'll send you it matters. Send you a pega to that address. So comment below. You want to win a renting scholarship, and I'll come and I'll pick a random winner using this from my previous videos, and pick a winner in my next video. So if you are interested, make sure you comment below now. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So Pegaxi is a racing game with futuristic mythological styling. Pega are descendants of Pega Pegasus. In this game, players will participate in pvp format races to win rewards in platform a native utility token viz so before i get actually before i get started in, in a bit more detail comment below if i'm pronouncing pegaxi correctly is it pegaxi or is it pegasi so let me know I, I don't really know what the pronunciation is i've been pronouncing it pegaxi some people saying it's pegasi so yeah comment below uh, which is the correct pronunciation i had a few comments in my previous video that i'm not pronouncing it correct so like i said it's a racing game and you win viz at the end there's also the breeding part which i think is the most profitable so if you can afford it and peg actually gets another rally this is a wildly profitable way and i'll get a lot more detail on breeding and finally renting again it's a, you won't earn as much renting but again compared to other play to earn i know lots of people moving away from axi infinity to play peg Axi just because the visit price has gone up so much and the earning potential is absolutely crazy so i'll talk about renting as well and like i said i'm giving away a pega as well if you're interested in winning that so uh, just to get in a bit more detail it's a pvp horse uh, racing each race is randomized element variable which includes wind water fire speed and more at the moment this is game is completely randomized it's not skills based going forward it's going to be skills based they're going to upgrade food skill and you know the players will have to be in the top three like now to win viz at the moment only the top three wins and i'll talk about how much they can you know expect to earn the i think it's 105 viz for the winner i'll go into a lot more detail on, on the winnings from the races within the game players are able to breed rent sell and of course race their pega to earn viz this system has proven to be a sound long-term economic approach when building an nft blockchain based game as it enables teams to build large kills scholarship programs and even provides solo players the opportunity to earn in-game tokens through daily racing so that's summary what the game is some key boring points but it's really important to talk about so pegax is built on the polygon matic layer 2 technology the two tokens are pgx and viz uh, they are going to bring into transition 3d i'm going to do some racings you'll see simple 2d there's not too much to the racing element uh, and i'll do some races in in, in this video uh, to share with you some gameplay but they are going to transition into 3d it's uh, the primary focus of racing game development is mobile gameplay that's going to come out soon as well so I talked about the in-game economic model the the large scholarship these are some amazing ways i mean i i, I used to play x infinity if you've you know followed up channel we got involved in uh, in axi infinity when the price of axi infinity was less than ten dollars it went absolutely parabolic 10x um, and uh, i think peg axi has improved uh, on the peg axi they've learned a lot from axi infinity the tokenomics of it the burning models of uh, uh, viz is amazing compared to peg axi uh, compared to axi infinity and they've really learned from it and they've gone a step further and they're struggling now with uh, slp supply similar to viz supply and they, they're, they're trying to come up with some burning mechanisms 
mechanisms which will make the game more sustainable i'm going i'll go get involved in a lot more detail but the team is amazing like i've said they're always updating us watch these videos i'll have to make another video it's been absolutely crazy busy i mean the way the market is dipping uh, we've had to you know short some coins to protect our wealth so we've looked to shorted avax and if you are interested in the rockstar trading group by the way so it's not just uh, we talk it's, uh, the, the groups become a lot more axi uh, uh, pay axi but again it's a trading group if you are interested i'll leave the links below for you to check out i live stream two to four times a week we, we talk about peg a lot obviously and um, trading markets uh, strategies courses and all that good stuff if you want to try us for less than uh for, for for a month or so you can try us for less than 30 bucks i'll leave the links below and like i said yeah, we call it a rockster trading group but it's become a peg Axie group because there's so much money to be made in peg Axie and play to earn games and i'm looking at other models as well so, so yeah apologies for a slight delay i wanted to get the video out sunday but it's a one day delay but hopefully you still enjoy the video um, so that's uh, the primary focus of the game and it's a community involvement and the eventual governance the player will determine the direction where the Pegaxi game goes and that's uh, what I like most about it and join the discord as well again you can check out our telegram group and our group but join the official Pegaxi um, a discord group that's where i learn a lot more about it so join the peg discord group you see when you speak to the team before you invest in it if you're looking to invest in a 10 20 grand make sure you do your own research on the project so this is the tokenomics so pgx is the governance token and then the, you've got viz this is uncapped this is minted and uh, burned so the burning so i'll talk about the metrics at the end that this is the key metric the the mint to burn ratio um that's how uh, the viz's price is determined and pgx is a governance token and it's like the axs token and this is the slp token if you want to compare it to uh, axie infinity this is the roadmap so you can see the roadmap uh, they've got some huge rollouts the, the the biggest one i'm looking for is the rollout of skill based control the mobile game is coming out the stadium event is going to be huge and just the update of the tokenomics and more burning mechanisms that are coming up that's going to really help the price of this to go up so that's just a quick roadmap and again read their white paper most information i'm going to share with you is from here and you can see how they're progressing they've you know they've got a roadmap the team is delivering that's what we want to see we've seen lots of scammy projects don't deliver nothing a peg axie has been listening to the team really well and then actually growing and listening and, and building something really special and that's what we uh, want to see so that's uh, the roadmap again read it yourself but the roadmap looks good and they're delivering on their promises this is the team and i've not even got everyone on the team Corey is the main guy that i follow he's the sort of the the, the face of the game uh, he if you watch the youtube or you follow him on um, follow follow them on discord he's one of the main guys always updating what's going on and um, even the price has gone down the, the team is still you know keeping us involved with updating us what's happening and you know this is what we want from a team we don't want to invest money in a team that is go radio silent you want an active team that listens to the investors and their customers investors as well this is something i look for when i love to invest in big projects pegaxi has some big investors uh, especially crypto.com and they've got some more investors as well and then um, again this is something very very big positive so um let's get involved so that's the sort of the overall gist of what the game is the team and my thoughts on it let's get involved in actually how to play so how to play i'll talk about playing and racing I'll, I'll come to the breeding aspect the marketplace and all the other stuff let's start with how to play so how to play you have to connect your wallet to the polygon chain so this is the most important part of this so if you want to play the game you need to make sure you download metamask and i'm not going to go through step by step there's lots of videos share it in my in my youtube channel sharing how to do it you've got to download metamask convert your metamask from ethereum to polygon there's a very good link so binance has a very good page which explains explains to you step by step how to do it you have to change it to polygon and the best way to get started is send matic from an exchange like binance or a kucoin or whatever exchange you use and transfer that matic to this new metamask address you've created through the polygon network once you've done that then you can use you know kyber swap network to transfer to convert your matic into usdt into viz into pgs and kyber swap uh, let me share that with you as well so kyber swap is the exchange that you can use so let me quickly share that with you you can swap that i'll bring that up here so use kyber swap they're a very good website and you can 
convert your matic into whatever you want so that's a very simple way of doing it and you can get the official kyber swap again there are lots of scams make sure you use the official one uh, to to start swapping your peg uh, start start swapping your Matic. So that's how you get started. Once you've got your Polygon uh, network MetaMask ready, you can start playing. So first thing you can do is buy or rent. I'll talk about that. And then you enter a race and then you prepare and see if you can win a race. This is a very simple step by step of what to do. So first step, if you're looking to buy it, go to the marketplace. Very simple to use. So if you've got your, uh, this is, I'm not connected to my main uh, wallet now, but if you connect, if you have a MetaMask already, you connect to it and you can look to buy so you can see different prices. One tip I'll give you is um, look for win rate. So buy one with higher win rate. That's the best tip I can give you. So if you're looking to buy a Pega, look to buy one with the highest win rate. That's going to be the best for you. The, the ones with higher win rate is obviously going to be a bit more pricey. But look to get one with above, you know, 25-30% win rate if you can. They'll be better. And also the price will depend on the breed number as well. If they've not been bred as many times, if it's a virgin Pega they will be cheaper uh, they will be sorry more expensive if they have been bred a few times then the price of pega will be a bit less so those are a few quick tips and i'll probably make a detailed video on how to rent and how to make money but that's just a quick update on you know how to buy your own pega um, and buying your pega there is a fee so there's sorry there's no there's no fee when you buy but if you look to buy and sell your pega there is a fee so i know some people want to make baby profit of buying and selling pega there is a three percent uh, charge when you sell your pega just to make you aware this is how to convert your so if you want to look to get started whether you rent or buy this is something you have to do download metamask convert it into polygon using this is follow this link and or watch one of my videos i'll go step by step how to do that once you've done it transfer matic from metamask to transfer matic from your exchange to metamask using polygon network and then you have matic in the polygon network you can use kyber swap to start converting it to usdt viz pgx whatever you want and start playing the game so that is if you've got you know four or five hundred dollars to play the game you can easily get started now if you want to rent it it's slightly different so there's two ways of renting you can rent a pega by paying pgx or you can rent a pega by sharing profit if you have some money you can rent it you know by 30 pgx or 40 pgx you can earn it for a day and you can race it 25 times and earn money through that as long as your pega, pega wins the other way is sharing profit you've got no risk at all uh, you can literally go here and pick one uh, you can see there's not as many so you have to be very quick it's very hard to get a one uh, that's why you know i'm helping people out by doing some giveaways but what you can do is you can click a pega uh, click it uh, and it's, you get five percent so let's say you earn 300 viz you earn five percent of the viz and the owner that you rent it from earns the rest of it and it's not a huge amount of money but some third world countries is still okay money so i'll quickly show you how it works on there so renting this is the renting part so you pay a rent the website's been super slow hopefully i can do sh i can share with you some racing gameplay so you can see you can earn you know you can have it for three days for 99 pgx and if you look at the pgx price pgx price is um at the moment 40 cent so you can work out how much you have to earn i'll go on to how much you can look to earn but you know look to get one with you know 25 uh, the highest number of energy and then you can uh, you can have it for a day race it and as long as you can earn more than what you've paid you can make some money so that's a good way of making money the other one is sharing profit and as you can see there's not too many around there's usually around you know 10 and people are just coming and snapping your hands off because it's basically free money you can get some money without putting any money in so that is a really good way of doing it but it is a bit more difficult to get so that's the racing part and uh, in the racing game i'll, I'll do some races now uh, live for you guys basically the first prize is 105 second prize 44 and it's 26 viz the next page i'll talk about the earnings and the earning potential dependent on the price let's do some quick racing so i've, I've just taken one pega from away from my scholar so hopefully my scholar is not too upset so this is the pega i've got i'll do a couple of races and let's see if we win one the previous video that i made i was I took a pega out from my scholar and we, we raced it and we won uh, I think the 100 viz which was pretty nice we'll see if we can win something now the gameplay like I said is very very simple there is a 3d version you can use but again it, it, the gameplay is, is nothing now it's a very early stage at the moment and um, the, 
you know, at the moment, they're just trying to build stuff. And like I said, in, in Q3, I'd expect the 3D version. I'll, I'll share with you some uh, pictures from the 3D game as well. It's, it's not that special. It's a very old looking, cranky. Um, it's an improvement to this 2D you know just horses running but again it's just a very very early aspect of the game i don't think you know long term uh, if they want to succeed they really need to improve that and they want to get to a level where people want to play this game without just because of the earning earning money aspect for me i'm i'm only playing this game to earn money and i'm being completely honest i do like the project and i want them to succeed but i'm mainly in it to make money and i'll talk about all the details of making money the goal for for me anyway is being able to get your money out so let's say you're investing 10 grand i want to you know make sure that you can get your money out so you know if you've seen my other videos of you know uh, time or ohm or x infinity i was able to get my money out not in ohm i'm still in ohm i'll i'll make an ohm video coming soon but pgx is where peg actually i've got my money in it still i want to be able to get my money out that's the uh, so the main goal for it uh, and then let's say you invest 10 grand i want you to be if the prices go up depending on how quick the prices go up i want you to be able to get some money out and then sort of free run that is sort of the goal or dream of this game i'll race once more and then if we win anything we win something if not we don't don't know what that was let's we let's race it once more it's a bit boring but let's see if we can win something whilst i'm making videos it's a bit of fun anyway but you can see the gameplay is very very new and it's got a huge oops there we go let's race it once more and then we'll carry on with the video it's a little bit of a break Come on, Rockstar Pega 3. Pega 3, sorry, it's Pega 5. And these are the speed, strength, and lightning. And again, at the moment, it's just randomized. It, they don't have an impact. But going forward, they're, they're, they've got some really good updates. And in my next video on Pegaxi, I'll talk about the details on on the gameplay and how the energy is going to be different, how you can pre Oh, mine's doing well. Any win I'd take just doing it live is just a bit of fun if we can win something so in the future i'm assuming these will have an impact on how much you can win so let's say you have two pegas with very high stats um, and if you breed them you'll get another pega with very high stats so the all this is coming i mean i've played axie infinity like i said all these improvements are coming so yeah that's a bit of fun so i've won um let's see how many, how many i've won it's not many so the is the top place you want to win uh, the third place isn't very good the more you win on the first place is the is what you really want but it's still not bad done it live and we won 26 pg so let's talk about earnings now so you just saw me win 26 viz and and how much you earn really depends on what the price of viz is so at the moment the viz price has dropped to about five cent and if it's five cent you know you could look to earn about three and a half dollars a day which is not amazing i know in the third world countries it could be good and if you have lots of visits it's good but the price isn't amazing in you know a few weeks ago i was earning over like a hundred dollars for doing nothing and you know the prices are 20 uh, 20 cent which the viz price was a few days ago uh, let me just go back and share with you um the viz price was over 20 cent you were earning some ridiculous amount of money so the price of viz depends how much you're going to earn if you get another parabolic rally you can build up p p uh, peg axes at cheap prices the the, pr the floor prices rises with there was two and a half grand at 1.3 grand just a few weeks ago so that's a really important thing it depends a lot on prices so it's difficult to just say how much you can expect to earn but these are some numbers that you know you can play with so on average i'd say you'd win about 60 70 viz and how much you'd earn will really depend on on um on the amount of vis or the price of visits and and how much you can earn you can really exp exponentially grow that if you have a lot of pegas and you can build your uh, earnings massively using that so that's the racing part let's come back to the breeding and in the breeding is where i said you know if you can really grow your stable and the price of uh, viz goes parabolic and you can earn a lot of viz by renting them out 
that's the sort of biggest way of making money. So a few things to talk about before I talk about breeding is there's different types of bloodlines. So there's Zan, Klin, Kampon and Hoz. Hoz was the most popular one because Hoz has got a better breeding time. So Hoz can breed after 24 hours, which is why everyone was buying Hoz to increase their profitability. And the Hoz's price uh, was still even because the supply of Hoz was so high. But at the moment, they've announced they're making some changes. Watch this video. I talk about the changes and you know they've made another update where they talk about changes again so i'll have to make another video soon and that will be coming out later in the week i'll also announce the winner then but they are coming out with more and more updates so um, we'll have to see how that plays out but at the moment if you ask me what to breed i'll say hoz and zan so my strategy again i used to have quite a few i've got i haven't got as many now but my plan is to breed up uh, two Hoz and two Zan. So this is a simple breeding model. And um, let me see if I've missed out anything. Uh, this is not something that I've missed out, but initially there was like legendary founding members and the more you breed them. So if you breed uh, to founding, you get a legendary. If you breed a legendary, you get an epic. But at the moment, most of them are Pacers. If you look to buy any, you probably buy Pacers. There's not too much important. And this is the cooldown time. So you can see the cooldown time. Hoz has got the quickest cooldown time. And that's why Hoz was really popular. I was only breeding Hoz. Now I'm doing Hoz and Zan, so that is another really important thing to remember. The new changes will allow Zan to race more. That's why the Hoz's price is going down and the Zan's price is going up because you'll be earning more Zan. So that is a really um, a good point to uh, to make so breeding model wise i'd probably recommend do both so if you can pick one at the moment zan's the more popular one so you could look to do zan but going forward i'll say if you've got enough money do both and this is a model that i'll share with you that you can look to do so you can buy maybe two hoz and two zans breed them or if you just do uh, zan or hoz let's say for this example say we're only breeding hoz you have m1 f1 so this is male one male so you buy four pegas basically um two males two females you breed them and again this is where it could get confusing so it says 50 50 but you could breed six and you might have four males and two females if that's the case i mean you can you can sell a female and buy a male or in our group we've got so many people breeding pegaxi we just transfer it in the group so that's one way of doing it but it, let's say you breed and you get three pegas at the moment three is still uh, profitable but again depending on the viz price and the price of pega but in simple terms you can i i used to do three i'll do two at the moment you can breed three and then with the uh, ones that you've created, you can breed them as well. And if you don't have equal numbers of males and females, you can go exchange it. So how much does it cost to breed? So these are the breeding costs. So the first breed is 2000. So it's really profitable. Second breed is 4000. And the next one is 6000. And it's really important to work out how much you're going to actually make. So let's get this calculator up. So at the moment, let's say I'll do this live so you can see how much you can look to make. So at the moment to buy uh, to viz it's going to cost you let's say 1420 so seven uh, uh seven ten times two and then to make a pega so to make them if you breed them to make a pega it's going to cost you roughly around 210 worth of dollars so using that so if you buy two buy this amount of viz so you need to so buy viz and pgx by 210 you can start breeding so your in initial investment cost would be 16 well i can just do the sum of it let me just share this with you quickly so it's going to cost you 1630 and then let's say you just want to get out completely you want to sell it all so you've got two hoz that are that have already been bred so that you'll get less price for it so let's just double check the price of hoz with one bread so hoz is 645 i don't know where i've got this from it's the first breed hoz so i've just got the calculator out here got it up here let me just quickly So the floor price of first bread is 645 so let's say so one will be 645 the second one will be 645 because you've just bred them and the first one is it 710 let me just double check the price of it yeah let's say 710 still so if you sold it all straight away i know there's like a three percent fee that you'll have to pay you just sort of made 400 dollars by not really doing much 
So that's the power of breeding. And um, and on top of that, once you've got them, you can be earning viz as well. And like I said, this is a hugely profitable. And I'll make, let me know, this video is going too long. And I wanted, I didn't want to make this too long video, but you know, it just shows you an introduction to how to breed, how to uh, start racing. And you can start seeing the power of it. And you know, like I said, if this game succeeds, it could be a really, really great time to get in. Some of the things to remember is token release. So this is for PGX, the token release. Um, when big whales start cashing out, we have to be aware of it. There's going to be a selling pressure. If you guys remember a couple of our altcoin trades, when the price drops, we best to get out. Um, this is another uh, chart. So let me get to the actual chart. So this, this is a really good page, DAP Radar. You can see the users the users were absolutely going parabolic at the moment the users are still looking okay but we can see that the volume is going down the interest in pegaxi is going down and you might be thinking not interested but if you believe in a project you want to get in before everyone else gets in you don't want to fomo in right at the top so that will be a really important point to make so i'm not saying this is the bottom i'll, I'll talk about the viz price in a lot more detail and where i think we, we might see a bottom but for me um, the users, you can see the user growth is still huge. If you compare it to um, some of the other um, games, and especially Axie Infinity, this has got a huge, huge potential. I mean, the market cap of this is not even in the top 3,000 cryptocurrencies. Even if it just makes you 1,000 or top 100, they, they, you, you could get a 10x from this game. So, again, very early, very high risk. I'm not saying, you know, if you have $10,000 to your name, don't invest all, you know, invest less. And then to see if you can start growing with it so you know that will be my thoughts on it but this is a metric i'll be watching the most important metric i've got in my presentation slide is the mint and burn ratio we can see the mint and burn ratio more was being burnt than minted that's when the price of pegaxi was going parabolic this was a valentine's day event so this was a bit of an outlier since then there's been more minted than burn and this is the most important metric if we have more minted than burn then the supply of viz will carry on going up and the price of this will likely go down so that is not something we want to see and long term i will be watching this if we carry on seeing more being minted than uh, burn i'm probably going to get out of this game and although i'm making a video sharing with you how much i like this game if we see that i'm not going to like this game so much that's sort of my long term the market is market cap is very low this game is very very early stage this could have huge potential to go up going forward and if you get a really good entry um, and if we get another rally this could be a very profitable entry so looking at the uh, pg the viz price action viz is at support at the moment but then it's broken it and unless viz can start getting back above eight cent and trend change above 10 cent i think viz is going to dip to here and if, if you watch my previous video my plan was a lower high here another lower high and then break out above you know end of this month early next month and looks like that's not going to happen looks like we're going to break down even lower so my next plan is that we accumulate around two to three cent if we start seeing accumulation around two to three cent similar to what we saw here this is what I call accumulation. If we see that here, I'm going to accumulate for the next rally up. And that will be the best time to get in. So if you've not got any pegaxi in, you could start buying a couple because it's so cheap and start playing with it. But if you want to invest, you know, 10, 30, 50K, I would say this is a zone to, after seeing accumulation trend change, you might not get the best entry, but that will be my ideal entry. Or if it starts getting back above 10, then I might change my plans and update you. But that will be my ideal entry. That's the video, guys. Slightly longer video. Let me know what you guys think. I went into a lot of detail on what pegaxi is how to raise how to breed shared with you some gameplay shared with you my strategies let me know if you have any questions and um, slightly longer video let me know if you enjoy this type of content if there's enough interest i'll carry on making pegaxi content there are some other content i want to make about best old coins to buy and my lunar staking videos my ohm updates are you know i put a couple in you know, the 10 grand in ohm just to share with you how much uh, i can look to make so that video is going to come out as well so uh, let me know your thoughts comment below your questions if you are interested in you know scholarship brands comment below your polygon axi at uh, call it polygon address long video guys i'm going to switch off now so thank you very much for watching if you have enjoyed it smash that like button subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification button if you are interested in the rockstar trading group where we talk about pegax in a lot more detail uh, share our trading you know share the short trades long trades i shared with you a couple of trades already other community members check out the group you can try us for less than 30 bucks if not guys just smash that like button subscribe to the channel and i'll see you guys soon with another great video thank you very much